Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm just gonna make a quick video to give you an update on Hotmail and its predecessor. And uh, we're gonna make an account there and it's gonna be leading on to a future video I'm gonna be making. So uh, to get started, I'm taking, I'm continuing from exactly where we left off in my last video where we made the VM of Windows 8 and then we 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 finished everything we set everything up and then we closed VMware player so now I'm just gonna open up open it up again so let's double click VMware player uh, right and click the Windows 8 VM and play virtual machine this is just just to show you guys how to start up a VM although this is not the main purpose of this uh, tutorial okay so now we're back now where we left off in our last video so we're in VMware so now um, this is this is Windows 8 of course you can do this in Windows 7 as well as there's no difference uh, this is the initial setup nothing has been installed nothing has been done in this virtual machine at all this is the Win Windows 8 virtual machine you can see I can personalize it I can change these are different um, backgrounds and stuff that Windows 8 comes with uh, if you guys don't know already this is the full retail version this isn't some developer preview or release preview this is the retail version of Windows 8 okay so uh, what I want to do is um, let's open up window Internet Explorer I, I, right now I don't have any other browser so that's the only thing I have Internet Explorer and uh, I want to go to uh, Hotmail just to show you guys you see Hotmail has let me full screen this Sorry, let me just change the screen resolution so you guys can see it full screen. Right. The one of the interesting thing in things in Windows 8 now is that it gives you this full array of screen sizes, whereas Windows 7 only had a small selection. There's a much bigger selection here. Click apply, and we'll keep the changes. Okay, all right, and let's go back to Internet Explorer. You can tell how it looks kind of different. You see this uh, metro theme, uh, how they've built in all the windows and their designs. Okay, so this is Hotmail. Um, if you guys don't know, Hotmail has been Microsoft no longer. They don't want to move forward as much with Hotmail. They've moved. They've in introduced a new interface. It's called Outlook. So this the main purpose is I'm going to be setting up an Outlook account right now. So outlook.com. Let's go there, and you'll see this is this is the new um, this new email interface of Microsoft. You can see here a preview of the modern email from Microsoft. So uh, let's go ahead. We'll sign up. We'll make a new account. Yes. I already have an account, but I'm gonna make one for Tech Void right now. So uh, name, call it Tech. Last name void. Void first. Right. I'm just fill in something. All right. What is the email we're gonna use? It's gonna be tech void. All right. Password will be. Oops, it's not long enough. Okay. Um, all right. And how can we help you reset it? Yeah, I don't really want to give a phone number here online. Let's just make one up. Uh, let's go six four seven. Oops. Make something there. Alternate email address. Um, so for this, we'll use techboard at gmail.com. Okay. Okay. And uh, from here, let's go on. We'll continue. The region, Canada, postal code. Uh, okay. Send me email with promotions. Sure, you can send me promotions. I don't mind. Okay. Let's click I accept. Okay. Uh, enter the characters you see here. 
Some of these things are really confusing when you look at them. You can barely tell what letters they are. And uh, I don't think it's case sensitive, but let's give it a shot. Alright, it's loading up. And um, I think we're pretty much done now. Alright, so uh, this is the new Microsoft Outlook email uh, client. I mean, it's not the email client. That's that's a software itself. But this is the actual email um, manager, I guess you can call it, that Microsoft uses now. It's no longer Hotmail. Hotmail is still there, but Microsoft wants people to move on with uh, Outlook itself. So here, see, Outlook is modern. You get a fresh, clean design that's intuitive to use. Outlook is connected. Your conversations come to like. Okay, yeah, you can connect your account with. Twitter, Facebook, everything can be managed through here. Um, you also get um, the SkyDrive space. So you get free Word, Excel, and PowerPoint web apps built in with 7 gigabytes of free cloud storage. That's referring to your SkyDrive account that comes with uh, this email when you sign up. And yeah, your data, data speaker, okay, you know that, of course. Um, Alright, so uh, let's continue. You guys can watch. You, you can watch this video if you want. But, uh, we'll leave that for after. You guys can watch it when you sign up. Let's continue. All right. So uh, this is it. Now we have our own uh, uh, email set up. The new Outlook client email. So I suggest you guys can go ahead and get get this uh, get one too. It only released about a month and a half ago, maybe two months ago. Microsoft released Outlook.com. So go ahead and get your email as soon as possible before your preferred ones get taken. Um, let's say you know you want to get your own name. It's if, if say your name's John, right? You know John at Outlook.com is going to be taken. But uh, of course uh, you want to get whatever preference you want. Uh, try and go get your the email you want right away before it gets taken because this new Outlook. Um, at outlook.com email this this is uh, this is something that will really take off in the future so even for windows 8 windows tablets windows phones all these things will require you to have an account even when we were making our windows 8 account you saw that uh, we had to type in an email um, to connect our email with the microsoft account so oh, for the future it's better it's better to sign up with one just in case so you have one ready of course many people use gmail and all these other clients but make one i suggest you make one here as well so um thanks a lot for watching guys in my next video i'm gonna i'm gonna show you guys the new my oh, microsoft office 2013 i'm gonna install that and show you guys how to how to set everything up so uh, i just set this email up right now so i can use that in the next demo thanks a lot for watching guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to comment rate and subscribe Take care.